Hello, this is Russ Buecher from Control My Icon, and in this tutorial video, we're going to take a look at how to change the look and feel, or basically the colors within Control My Icon. By default, when you install Control My Icon, it has a very dark interface, kind of looks like this. This is called the default theme, and it's just a darker color with a lighter uh, text. And uh, this is the same look and feel in all the different windows. So, for example, here's the Live View window. Uh, for control my icon. So it looks the same. Now you could change this. Some people find that the dark color isn't quite as easy to uh, use. So what you can do is just go up to the tools menu and down to themes. And here we have a different list of themes that you can use on uh, control my icon. So by default we had one called default, this dark one. But let's try a different one. We're going to call it um, calcium. And automatically this will change for you. When you restart Control My Icon, it'll come back up to the same light colored theme if you like. You can even disable themes if you like, and it brings it back to kind of a, a Windows look. It's kind of ugly though, and uh, you get your best look and best performance within Control My Icon if you keep the themes enabled. So let's try some different ones. That's calcium. We have another one called, oh, let's see, uh, Pulsar is not too bad. Kind of a metallic look to it. And you can change the hue and saturation. You can see there's a bit of a, a blue happening here. So you could change that to whatever color you're comfortable with. You can make it a very rich color or almost bring it back to a, a grayscale. Let's try a couple more. Another very dark one is TVB Light. popular one is Web 2. So basically you can use any of these themes that you like. It remembers what the theme is when you restart. Go ahead and feel free to pick whatever theme you like to use. Thanks for watching.